This video is covering the key points to look for when selecting goats, focusing specifically on the back end. From a side profile, there are three main points. The length of rump, width of thigh, and depth of muscle. The length and slope of the rump. Some tails sit differently, so it's important to look from the hip bone to the end of the animal. This animal's rump length and angle is sufficient. This animal has a steep rump and the length of rump could be longer. The width of thigh. You can often see the outline of where the thigh ends. For depth of muscling, we are looking for it to come as far down towards the hock as possible. The first two examples are at a different picture angle, but you can see good length of muscle where the third animal cuts in earlier and lacks depth and width. So we have looked at the length of rump, width of thigh and depth of muscle. A side profile can still tell you a lot about the animal's back end muscle. When looking from behind the goat, we look at the width of rump, the outer and inner thigh, and the depth of muscle. You should be able to see the width of the rump. We are looking for a nice full rump that doesn't fall away to the sides. You should be able to see the outer thigh muscle, otherwise called the twist, running down the leg. It should not be flat and empty. The inner thigh should be full and well fleshed. Many goats lack muscling in the inner and outer thigh. This slide clearly shows on the left a buck with good inner muscling and on the right a buck with less inner muscling. This slide shows the depth of meat through the stitch and also down to the hock, showing a full back end. Both of these pictures are of animals under the same conditions and show a vast difference between the two photos. The buck on the left has an excellent back end and the bucks on the right are lacking. So you can see from the back profile there are a number of aspects to consider as well. The width of the rump, the outer and inner thigh, the depth of meat at the stitch, and down towards the hock. Visual assessment is part of the selection of goats and for industry members dealing with stud stock an awareness of the breed standards is important. Being exposed to a number of good quality animals in both paddock and show condition is helpful. And a big thank you to the breeders that shared their photos with the hopes of furthering the goat industry.